Removing your video background in 2025 is very easy and here is three methods for streamers and video makers. These methods work for PC or Mac, including platforms like TikTok Live. So method one is the app I just showed you. That is the NVIDIA Broadcast app. You need a 20 series or above graphics card on your Windows PC. And you just click on video once NVIDIA Broadcast is open. You click on the drop down and select the right camera. And you find this virtual background option and toggle it on and click the drop down and choose one of the options. I like remove. And then in my broadcasting software, I just add the correct background as an image source or as a video source. And then in my broadcasting software, I just add a camera source and that camera source is called NVIDIA Broadcast. Here's another option. This one uses TikTok Live Studio. So find your camera in the sources and click on settings and click on this background option. Then just click on this cutout option and you can see my background's now removed with no green screen. You can then press this custom option to add your own backgrounds or you can press add source and choose video to add your own video background. Make sure that is dragged as a source beneath the camera source. The third option will use your real green screen and this will work on anything including Live Studio, OBS, Meld and Streamlabs. I'll do it in Live Studio. You want to start by cropping your camera using Alt to remove parts of the camera that are not the green screen. And then you want to find the chroma key filters. On OBS you right click and choose the filter option. On Live Studio I go in settings for my camera and I once again click on background. I click on cutout but this time I check the chroma key option. I click the drop down for chroma key settings. So here are the settings and you just tweak these until the preview looks good. For me, I just have to improve the similarity. Sorry, I mean increase the similarity a little bit. And as you can see, my preview now looks good. So I just press apply and you can see my green screen chroma key effect is working very well. I've covered all three of those methods and how to get the graphics for the background in much more detail you can find that on my channel or below.